Alright, so tap tap, and welcome back to one, the off fan game. You should probably watch the earlier videos in the series if you, you know, have not done so. Is you know, it's in the middle of a playthrough, but um our father, Zachary. <laughs> Excuse me. I have ugh, I hate I hate allergies, I hate grass, I hate pollen. Anyway. Um our father, who was Zachary, was kidnapped by a big blob thing. And we're gonna go beat up the blob thing, I guess. And we're gonna call it Pedalo. Which is a, um... Eh? Where, where does the Pedalo go? By the way, I, I never quite connect the dots that Zachary is a French name. I just... Uh, I guess I don't know the, na the origins of different names and stuff. Na names is just names. Oh, so where's the pedal? Oh, hey, the new. It's also kind of bat-like, but there's a new creature. I like spaghetti creature. I will say that this game is a little bit loud. I have it on half my usual volume, and it sounds like I have it at my usual volume, so it's like twice as loud as I would expect. But whatever. Luck to get received. Oh, we got level three. So is the Pedalo out here? There it is! Pedalo is a rubber duck. Wait, is does Pedalo just mean duck? A Pedalo or paddle boat is a small human powered watercraft. Oh, okay. So that's. I, I guess that's probably another thing that, like, it's a French word, but it kind of exists in English, so it just did not get uh, translated in the original thing. It's kind of interesting how things like that actually add character to a game, though, because, like, Pedalo is very memorable to me, because I don't usually hear that. Um, I, like, if they, if it just called it Paddle Boats, I would think that would be a lot less interesting, actually. Oh, no. Oh, it was one, two, three, four. Oh, the, the, the blocks are out of play. That's interesting. Wow, because that, that's the, the, um, we saw the hint for that in that room, too, but these are... This is the block puzzle that was um in the uh, in that other room. Interesting. The one frustrating thing about RPG fan games usually they're too short to really have much depth in the gameplay. So if there's an auto option, you usually just want to use it. Unfortunately, um, it's you know you're playing it for this for the. Uh, I wonder. Um, no, nope. Nothing doing. Oops. <laughs> the Pedalo is doomed now. I can probably just reset it though. Oh! This is back. Going into the metal mines. You. What's the swan for? Oh, do you stay out of this? <sighs> do not leave me without Papa. Hate to break D, kid, but your father's needed elsewhere. <gasps> I actually don't have to break D. In fact, I love it. H. <laughs> Give Papa. <laughs> Look at my eyes, they got itchy. Give Papa back now. What's this? You're burnt? How absurd. I'm burnt? Oh no. That's when the, um, the, 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 the Nelsons, or whatever they're called. Uh oh. Um. Crap, what are they called? Off burnt. Elsons, Elsons. Close enough. Those are the um the dudes with the, the little heads. And then they go um oh, hang on. Is this a remix? This is a remix. These friends with the head that goes explode. Very good. I like those guys a lot. Yeah, this is definitely a remix. Uh, to listen to me from the beginning, burnt child. <laughs> I hope people don't get sick of my southern voice. It's very good. And I will not hear no words otherwise, boy. I'm about to face off this damn world. I keep m meaning to do it for like a one off joke of a character that like is here for like one second. And I keep doing it for like really major characters. And Buttons is not doing so hot. 
Let's use the luck to get on buttons. He's not doing... No, he's doing bad. This is really well produced. I'm gonna get somebody... Oh no. Oh god. Oh shit! <laughs> okay. Um, serious. Serious time. Um. Serious time now. Um, nah, we're, we're, we're getting a game over. Yeah, we're, we're definitely getting a game over. Um, fortune ticket. Oh. Oh, it defaulted to do. You gotta be kidding me. Crap. Verification failed. Good night. You too, game. You too, game. One thing I hate about doing, um, crap, I have to do that again. One thing I hate about doing Let's Plays of, um, of, uh, oh, I look called the Benalo. Um, RPG Maker games is that if you record the inside of the window, it's kind of the necessary way to record things, um, you get these little borders that I have to remove, like, every time. Oh, God, I just noticed there's, there, it's fixed now. Crap. There's a little bit of extra, ugh. It's stupid. All right, I'm gonna grind briefly, and I'm gonna go back to that fight with full health. So I will see you in a minute. All right, we are level five now, so we and fully healed, so we should be good. Um, one thing I did want to say, I think one of the most important things in making a good RPG Maker game is an aesthetic that really works, um, because the default assets have a very default RPG Maker look, and it it's not. They're not even bad assets, but just something about it. It just looks like you didn't care because that's just the default So when you get a game that looks like this and they did a good job of you know matching the style and keeping everything very consistent um, It matters a lot to making it look like a you know, <laughs> I hate to sound pejorative, but it makes it look like a real game, you know, it makes it not look like it just a you know simple Fan thing that took three seconds to just you know put together this is the room that we fought Sugar in, isn't it? He doesn't get very burnt for a burnt, does he? Whatever. We got new skills, by the way. We got a new competence, I should say. Charge with Valor! The, the low impact, also. This is all allies attack. Ooh, good. Bloodthirst. Bl blinded? Wait, wait, did that- did that blind me? I thought it would blind the enemy. Meat attack, inflict blindness. I thought it was inflict blindness on them. Whatever. Gla gelatinous intruder of zone zero. Weakness non-resistant none. 100 HP, that's good to know. I was just thinking like... Smoke element. Oh no, smoke was an element too. Smoke, sugar, plastic. Meat? The metal was not an element, it was smoke. It was, um... What a difference a little grinding and having full HP matters. Now this is a cakewalk again. That was a really unlucky start last time, really. We both got poisoned instantly and we both had like half HP or less. And now this is just gonna be a cakewalk. Yep. Adversary's purified. That was expensive. Which is a fan game kind of annoyance, like... You usually don't know if you even need to grind in fan games. Fortune ticket. Which in this case just a teeny little bit, I guess. What? This is impossible. Beat my child. Top it off, burnt child. Where's Papa? Forget about him. He's long gone. My master plans for him. If you manage to find him, you stand no chance against him. Honestly, imagine like a giant blob monster and it had a southern voice. You'd be terrified. Don't even don't even lie. Give up now, watch still. <laughs> I love the the blood splat. And just the, the fact that it's like the only red thing in the game. It's really... Well, I guess there was red areas, but no. It's, it's still really stark. By the way, when... when it almost sounds kind of cheap, but one thing I've noticed that really works in RPG Maker games... Use an incredibly limited palette. Use like four or tone... Like, pretend you're making a Game Boy, basically, right? Um, four tones of the same color. That worked really well in Crystal Confines. Um, it tends to work really well in Off. It's very low color and it's not 
it's not, I'm not trying to call it like easy or cheap or anything, but it's not the hardest thing to do. You just need to pick good colors. You need to, you know, keep your palette consistent. Consistency, I would say, is the biggest thing. I mean, obviously, you still need an art style and stuff, but um, I think it really helps. That really helps it stand out. It helps you. You can do th stuff with mood with palettes really easy that are uh, harder to do with like a fully colored game. A Leo card has been found. It's access to zone one. I forget exactly when we got the Leo card in the original game. I might have to do. You know, if we're gonna play all these off fan games, maybe I should just restream the original one to refresh my memory and everything. Let me know in the comments if you think if we should uh, stream some off. Let me know if you'd be down for that. I should have, by the time this video posts, I should have my new fiber internet, and I should, I should not have problems anymore. I heard quite the commotion downstairs. I'm ecstatic to see you alive in one piece. Thank you, able to find to off Gotti. Do beat Big Blob Monster, but no matter, Papa still need help. Do will make bad monsters pay for hurting Papa. Zounds! I'm not sure if you are aware of your current appearance. You appear to be that of a burnt to do. Burn? Big blob monsters say the same thing, don't know what you mean. It means you're in danger of becoming physically and mentally unstable. If you do not learn to control it, you'll be consumed by your own instability and die. I can't help you not become burnt, but I can help you control it from worsening. Do not want to die, please help. Mm. Just keep your emotions from becoming too drastic, simple as that. But strength from that subject, we believe the object outside is fully functional now that God is slain. If you hope to find your father, you must travel to the other zones. Maybe you'll find the most something, something there. I'm sure you'll let most figure something out. Ghosty, no come? Said they must respond to negative. Time for not being of great help. Thank you, fancy ghost man. This guy's accent is like inconsistent. Like he's talking about offing things and he's like, yes, I cannot be of much assistance. Now that doubt is out of the picture, I feel my place here is protecting this zone from corrupt outside forces. Thanks! Wish you luck, dude. Thanks, buddy. Well. You know what? Return to the nothingness. I think we should probably call that a video. I just want to return to the nothingness real quick here. There it is! World map set. I always love this world map. It's so strange. I don't know if we had actual control over walking around it like this, did we? The room. It's impossible to enter. You require the adequate Zodiac card. Zone zero. Where's zone? Wasn't there a zone four? Hmm. Wow. You know what? We'll save at the first entrance of zone O. Oh no, it's still here. All right. If you're if you're a stinky naughty person that are, is watching without off, the, these zones were originally colored when they were purified by the batter. That's when they turned all white. And that's when everything kind of died, except for weird monsters that roam. I, I I do highly recommend watching the original series and just play it for yourself. It's a, it's a free game. This is you know the fan game is also free. I guess I probably don't need to point that out, but uh, yeah. I don't know if, if Morse Ghost ever made another game, but they're, they're, they're usually more of an artist, I guess. But yeah, games are art too, so you know. But I, I don't know if they ever made anything else. If, if they ever do, somebody let me know immediately, please. And uh, do feel free to let me know about other good fan games like this. I did not expect this was this long. I, I thought I was sitting down for something quick, so I teeniest bit betrayed by that, but <laughs> it's good, so it's not a big deal. But I had hoped to just do a quick little thing. It's freaking, it's 10 in the morning. And I, I didn't really plan to do this for too long. I'll be hurting my voice if I continue too much longer. But this is where we're going to wrap up the video. Um, this is one. This is really cool. And I'm so glad to be getting back into off stuff. See you next video. If you're enjoying the playthrough, make sure to like and subscribe and all of that YouTube stuff.